Ahoy! This is the 8th episode of the class review video series. If you haven't already, I suggest that you watch the introduction video first. Let's talk about Force Gunner. I'll be honest, I know very little of this character as I haven't played it much, so apologies in advance if I forget about something. It's a magic class which uses an astral weapon with amazing accuracy. Indeed, gunners have more accuracy than any other class, making their hits miss virtually never. Force Gunner has some powerful attack skills, most of them with increased penetration and critical damage and high stun chance. A passive skill also increases critical rate, making it much easier to gear up than some other characters. Gunner's got a buff which increases damage and survivability by a small amount, but it's very useful because it can be used indefinitely and on any number of players. Force Gunner's short skills are kind of like a mix between Wizard and Archer. They mainly rely on critical damage, but also grant significant increase to penetration, and while their overall damage output isn't as significant as Wizard's, they've got a lot better damage than Archer's. The previous update greatly increased their survivability, with new short buffs added, but otherwise Gunner's main skill behaves like it does for Gladiator, capping the incoming damage to a maximum amount. This means you can still die when lots of enemies hit you, but is otherwise quite powerful, albeit with a long cooldown. They've also got a significant debuff, which decreases the target's amp resistance by a huge amount, which is a very welcome in parties. Gunner's BM1 is nothing special. BM2 uses an astral weapon replacing normal attack and hitting in about a straight line between you and your target, much like Archer's BM3 attacks. Gunner's BM3 has a similar area too with decent range and additional penetration to help against strong enemies. It's also the only battle mode that grants its user a large boost to movement speed and thus great mobility for its duration. For good measure, all battle modes increase accuracy even further in case, in case you didn't have enough already. All in all, Force Gunner is a good damage dealer, but its main disadvantage is that all, and I mean really all of its battle modes and area attack skills get damage penalty for hitting multiple enemies. It's also a battle style added to the game years after its launch, which is part of the reason why few people play it, and it's hard to find decent gear for it. And being a magic class, you'll need decent gear to stay alive, so it's not a favorite character of new players.